Okay, this is how you zinc sync your Xbox 360 Elite controller to your Xbox 360 Elite console. You know, many people they um turn on the the console, which is turned on right now, and they turn on the this console and the. Push the zinc button on the 360. You push it zinc button on this one, and uh, people try, try different ways how to do it to and stuff. So I uh, try a different way. It's not syncing at all. So, you just turn it on, you hit this, and you hit the zinc button on that one. So it kind of was syncing, but the trick is here that some people don't realize that the, the console has to be connected to the TV first. Like uh, either AV cord or HDMI cord. Make sure your HDMI or AV cord is connected to your uh, TV, and you'll see the difference. But in my case, it'll be the HDMI cord. So I'm gonna go ahead and connect the HDMI cord over here. See the HD. Am I cord on my TV? <coughs> so that's connected. And it should zinc by now. See? And it has to be turned on by the screen. See? It's zinking. It automatically sinks. Sinking to your Xbox 360 Elite. Make sure your console is turned on and it's connected to your TV, the HDMI or AV cord, whatever. A lot of people don't show this part, but I show this part because I've gone through all the other bullshit. And trust me, none of it works except this. What happens is that uh, Microsoft has specific ways in order to program um, the controllers and the console the pro pro program how uh, the different ways are the the product works you know they have a, so kind of really had to think about it so just make sure the tv is on and uh, the AV port is on. You can enter the TV with the HDMI, okay? <clears throat> and trust me, it'll work unless if the console or the controller doesn't work, this will work. See, it's perfectly synced. You guys have a good day. Hopefully, this helps somebody struggling out there syncing their. Xbox 360 controller to their console. Remember, it has to be turned on first, right? connected to your TV. You guys have a good day.